Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode one of Risky Runs Through My Time at Porsche. I decided to give this game a shot because I heard it was a lot like Stardew Valley, and man, did I love Stardew Valley. Uh, without further ado, let's get started. New game. If you ever meet your one true love, you can buy the wedding ring from the mysterious salesman. The mysterious salesman. Uh, the wedding ring sounds a lot like the boutique in Stardew. Drawn some parallels already. Um, all right. Hey, let's start off. We can be male or female. We'll go with male. I think I'll go talk with the research center first. I think they I'll might go think with of a different voice. I think I'll go talk with the research center first. They might think of something. I think I'll go talk with the research oh, center first. Why is that guy yelling? They might think of something. It's like they recorded each of those voices at different audio levels. <laughs> Quiet. I think I'll go talk with the research center first. They might think of something. I think I'll go talk with the research center wow. first. They might think of something. I don't like any of those, so... I'm going to go with disable player voice, and I will be your narrator for this journey. Um... All right, let's change our hair. How's my hair looking today? Kind of flat and to the side. Flat and to the side, wonderful. Hair length, we'll make it short. Hair color, we'll go pretty dark. Yeah, right about there, looks good to me. Uh, name, before we get too far, risky. Um, all right. Face type. Ugh. Yeah, you can like see inside of his skull. Look, look, you can see his eye sockets. Oh, it's a nightmare. No, no. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Oh boy. Oh, <laughs> this. Uh, these are pretty good. Giant anime eyes. That one's okay. That. I feel like we, we're going to go with the stock one, I think. It's the least... Ter maybe this one. It's got big lady lips, though. Yeah, we'll, sti we'll stick with this guy. Uh, if we get a little darker, maybe not that dark. Nice little tan, make it look like we get out in the sun once in a while. Um, upper face. Brow position, brow shape, eye size, eye shape, eye height. Holy cow. Let's just change the color. How does that sound? We'll go for dark brown on both accounts. And that didn't seem to actually change the colors of his eyes whatsoever. Okay, hey, whatever. Not really that important. I'm sure we won't be looking into the face of our character that often. Uh, lower face, same type of options. We can change lip color, but those are fine. Uh, beard, let's say if we can get a sweet beard. <laughs> that looks real funny too. It looks like a 12 year old with a dollar store beard that he just kind of like taped onto his face. I don't love it. Uh, we can make it real big. Either way though, even if we make it darker, it looks weird. He needs, I need a wrinkles option or like a, hey, I've been through some stuff in my life. So uh, I am not a child. But uh, since we're not getting that, I think I might just go. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I can't do it. Uh, then we can also do face paint. What? Can I just be a normal person? I can't. Oh, I can even change the pattern color, which I don't need to. Um, all right, I think we're good. Uh, choose my birthday. Uh, the 18th? The 18th is my birthday, so that works. And what is after the 18th? The day of the bright sun. The day of the bright sun celebration goes on from 10 till 2 in the afternoon. Uh, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I don't know if... Having our birthday the day before the bright sun celebration is the best idea. If we have a late night of drinking, uh, bright sun celebration, probably not the way to go. But it is what it is. Oh, it is what it is until I realized I could change the months. So we'll go to month three, which is March, and 18th, which is my birthday. And that'll be a few days before the autumn festival. Let's do it. Every time you level up, you'll gain skill points. Cool. So... RPG elements, it seems. 
good deal. We didn't really have that in uh, starter. All right, here we come. I think we're waving to that bird as we went by it. Hey, nice ship. Ooh, I like the way it looks. I like the rundown, the vegetation growing and stuff. Ooh, ooh, wow, hello. Whoa, that looks beautiful. What are you gonna do there? Ruin diving? I hope so. Uh, yeah, something like that. Get someone like you once in a while. Always seeking that adventure. Good to be young. Great to be young, Wuwa. So great to be young that we well, jump off boats before they stop. Thanks a lot, Wuwa. Have a good one. I am genuinely pretty excited to get into this game. My time at Porsche, ladies and gentlemen. So it begins. Hello, Presley. Presley, how do you do? Ah, good to see you again. Hope you had a again? pleasant journey from Barnarok, right? That's quite far. Ah, yes, Barnarok, my hometown. Yeah. Yeah, we're very short. It's a good thing we didn't put someone else to voice act this, so I can anyway, add things besides I'm just... I'm here to show you to your yeah. workshop, so if you would please Period. follow me, it's pretty close. I wonder what it's like. I didn't get to know my pa too well. No one's been working there since your pa left Porsche so many years ago. He was a good friend. Hmm. The next parallel is drawn. Pa left us a workshop, and Grandpa left us a farm. Rolling in properties. And yet again, our answer? Yeah. Period. Alright, uh... Dash... We got some jump, we got some auto run. I love me a good auto run. Ooh, I also love me some volleyball. Hey, don't wander too far. All right, hey, I don't love volleyball as much as I thought. Let's go, Presley. And here we are, your oh, workshop. My workshop? This place sure looks beautiful. Where and what do you think? It looks homey. That's all we think. Now then, here's a letter from your father. He asked me to present it to you when you've seen this house. All right. Ooh, from Dad. This is probably going to be a gut wrencher. Risky. When you read this level letter, <laughs> I will already be on the other side of the world. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry that I'm not the father you wanted me to be. This was all so sudden, so I didn't have much time to tell you or figure out how to take care of you. Then I thought about this workshop. It might not look like much now, but it will brace you from the wind and cover you from the rain. I left my workshop handbook that details how I created things in my workshop. The rest is up to you. Do your best and live a wonderful life. You will always be my pride and joy. Pa. Not love Pa. And he also claims that I'm his pride and joy, yet he's gone. Maybe we'll uh, dig into the backstory here and figure out where Pa went. Maybe we'll go rescue him from dragons or monsters or robots or something evil. Maybe. Uh, day one, month one, year one. Let's Here's go. Here's the workshop handbook of your pa's. Take your time. Come to the Porsche Commerce Guild tomorrow. It's located around Peach Plaza. Can't miss Peach it. Peach Plaza, my favorite plaza. As much as I'd like to give you a builder license right away, you need so to prove do it. your worth through a couple of tests. Couple of tests for my builder's license. Got it. Tomorrow. Anyway, I'll leave you be. Get some rest. No problemo. Bye, Presley. Thanks for all your help. Good morning, everybody. Time to get up. But, ow, my head hurts. I didn't sleep well at all from the breezes coming through the cracks last night. Uh, yep. All the breezes coming through all the cracks. Can I zoom in? Can I find these cracks? There's some holes in the floor. Oh, hey, it looks like there's holes in the window, kind of. It's one of those good dual layered windows. Uh, fix this gap, yes. Use three wood to fix this gap. Well, we don't have that. Are these all three? Use wood to fix this gap. 20? Where are we gonna find 20 wood? Wood's expensive. 
and 10. That is 36, yes, check my math skills, 36 pieces of wood that we need to uh, patch up our floor and maybe have a good night's sleep. What do we got over here? The home panel. Uh, furniture. We have none. Um, health, stamina, attack, defense. You can gain attribute bonuses by furnishing your home. That's pretty cool. Okay, so depending on what kind of furniture we put in there, I guess we're going to get bonuses to our defense, attack, stamina, and health. Uh, all good things. The helper options. Stop harvesting crops. Stop gathering animal products. Stop doing a whole bunch of different things. Uh, helper options. So it sounds like, which this is kind of cool, we can actually have helpers in this game. Uh, maybe people to help build things, help harvest things, help add food for animals, all that good stuff. Uh, that's a big difference from Stardew, where Stardew you just kind of, your spouse would pretend that they were helping, and you had to go through a really long process to marry them, and then help have them help you. It wasn't great. Uh, and then we have a helper log here, which I'm assuming is just going to chronicle all the things that they do daily. So let's get out of here. We got some tests to pass today. Uh, the glowing objects are most likely to be collectible resources. Pick them up with E, press E for help, and the mission target with M on the world map. Um, okay, so right here, go to the Commerce Guild, yep. Uh, inventory, why did you guide me here? There's nothing new. Okay, um, you can't see this because of where my picture is, but the top bars over here to your left our experience, we're at level 1, 0, 1200. Health, we have 110 of 110. Stamina, 120 of 200. And endurance, 100 of 100. And then the next one under there is attack. So lots of different stats, which is kind of cool. Uh, character, we have a skill tree. Click to add skill points. Each skill has a different upper limit. At most, five points can be added at one level. Add five skill points to each level to unlock the next one. The final skills have stronger effects. That is awesome awesome that we have a skill tree here for our crafting game uh fight gather and then social i love a good social game smooth talker 20 percent chance to receive one additional relationship point that doesn't seem like a lot i feel like we're probably gonna get into gathering early on um decrease in stamina when doing things like pickaxing and using an axe um, sounds like the way to go uh, missions, we need to go to the Commerce Guild and meet Presley. Uh, so let's hop on it. After we check our mail, obviously. From the Porsche Times. Hello, new subscriber. This is the Porsche Times. We are sponsored by the city government and the local Commerce Guild branch to bring you the latest news in our city for free. We're a monthly publication, so papers will be sent out on the first day of each month. If you have any questions or concerns, please do not hesitate to visit our office on Main Street. Sincerely, the Porsche Times. All right. Maybe we will do that. Um, all right. So we're going into town. Hello. Hello, Liyua. Do you know Wuwa? Who are you? Jack of all trades. One of the Hulu brothers. The Empire. So probably... Huh? Um, You're just the am new I a spy of the Duvos Empire? Mm. That sounds like fun. I kind of wish I was. Maybe I am. Who knows? Um, chat. When I was little, I always tried to imagine that I was invisible. For a while, kind I actually sad. believed it myself. Until my teacher told me to... Oh, to you, uh, you funny guy. Uh, we can gift, which we don't have anything to give him anyways. Oh, hey, I wasn't known to you yet. Uh, we can spar... Sounds scary, might want to level up before we do that. Some RP at rock, paper, scissors? Oh, it took five stamina. Um, all right, hey, start with rock. Not a great choice. Um, scissors? Uh, we'll stick with scissors. Wow! Absolutely obliterated by Leoa, who is not a great winner. Oh yeah, I won. Shove that right in my face. What a jerk. Hello. Suddenly, my sadness from losing my game has gone away. Emily. Hey there. I'm How Emily, do you do? Next door neighbor. It's so nice to have new girl next door. Town. You should drop by my ranch sometime. Will do. Let's uh let's Emily chat quick. I'm having trouble remembering things. I wonder what I can do to help her. Do. Give her some Alzheimer's medicine. I guess. Um 
I don't, yeah, we're good. I'll see you around, Emily. Have a good one. I gotta go pick up some sparkly bundles of sticks and rocks and sticks and what are these? Snake berries? Yes. Very important. Gather some more wood. Okay. Okay, great. We gathered some wood and some snake berries and a couple rocks. Um, all right, let's get, whoa, hello chest. I don't know how I didn't see that earlier. Survey says, worn gloves. Sweet, let's put them on. Attack. Oh yeah. Woo! Did you see that kick? Dang, like Jet Li. Yeah! Impressive stuff. What do we got going on here? You wanna fight about it? Come on! Coward. Wah! Don't hurt me. Mars, don't be a coward. You will fight me. Come on, let's see what you got. Yeah, doesn't want to fight. Level five, I'm a level one. Oh boy, that, my, that guy does a lot more damage than I do. And there's a cat meowing. Whoa, dodge him. Oh my goodness, he's gonna wreck me. I gotta stay on top of him. It's not gonna matter. My dodge, oh. And then roll. Let's get the kick in. Kick's doing the most damage. Oh yeah, right in the face. Oh boy. So we can't, yeah, we can't get in that final kick, I don't think. Oh, punched in the back of the head while I was running away. Uh, plus one to our relationship, but negative three to our monies. I should have fought this bear. Nope, probably not a good Hi, idea uh, if I couldn't beat that guy. You must be the person that the man was talking about. I'm kind of simple, but I hope we can be friends. You don't look simple at all. You're wearing a bear skin. You run around a lot. You should run in the fields when the I sun do. is high up in the sky. It's a lot of fun. Is that an actual game mechanic? Or is that just some fun writing? We'll never know. All right, hey, people, I'd love to stay in chat, but we do need to go to the Porsche Commerce Guild. Let's go. Nice to see you. Nice How to see you. you. In? Is that a peacock? Uh, very well. Great. Let me introduce you to the Commerce Guild. All right. We're the organization that orchestrates trade across the entire Free Cities region. This is the Porsche branch. We're pretty busy throughout the year. Understandable. Now then, let me give you your builder test. Relationship. This is pretty easy. Make an axe and pickaxe and bring them to me. That does seem pretty easy. You need Let's to have it. wood and stones to make these. You can gather them on your own or buy them from the Total Tools in Central Square. Total Tools. After you have the raw materials, you'll need to craft the items on a work table. I saw your paws on one in your yard, so check and see if that still works. Will do. All right, start our builder test. Let's try to get this builder test done before the end of the episode. I am suffering for the bit of allergies, so if I sound sniffly, I do apologize. Usually that clears up pretty quick. You know, I thought those were chests up there. I saw them up there. Just chests everywhere. What do we get? Oh, some salad sauce. The best sauce, some would argue. There goes Emily, our future girlfriend. Uh... I'm gonna have to level up my jumping ability. Hit, hit. Nope, not gonna happen. All right, quickly. Let us finish up this first test to the workbench. Uh, tools. Oh, we need a lot of stone, huh? All right, so let's go collect some stone. Yeah, there's some. Can't just hold down shift. I want to just be sprinting all the time. All right, this should be plenty of stone. 
Uh, and then we can probably build... Depending on what we're short on, we'll either build the axe or the pickaxe. Uh, okay, we have a lot more stones. So let's just build the simple axe. We can go cut down some trees. Okay, we got our axe. Wonderful. Let's equip said axe and go chop down some trees. Chop down this giant tree. You need a better axe. Okay. There we go. Okay, we can hold the mouse button. Don't have to click it repeatedly. This does take down, it looks like, two bars of stamina uh, per hit. But that's okay. We got some tree sap along the way. But that should be enough. Oh, nice. So there's a mission tab, so you can just build whatever uh, you need there. Um, boom! Bada bang! Bada boom! We have crafted our pickaxe and our axe. Standard axe, I guess. Um, let's grab some more of these materials. Clearly, they are useful since we had to use them a couple times already. I don't want to hack down any more trees because I don't need to right now. Gust. He's so fast he went by in a gust and there's a pig chasing him. Run, bro. Run. Everyone's running. No one walks in this town except for this little plump guy. Gale. What a name. A and G construction. So much to explore, but we are on a mission for this episode to finish up our first builder's test. So let's talk to Presley, see what ah, he's got to say. Excellent quality. Nicely done. Yes. You can keep them. I just and want I to see what keep you them. can do. Now for the second test, you are to build a stone furnace. Second test. This one's a bit tougher. You need to use the assembly station in your yard to complete this task. All right. Pretty easy. And we'll be saving that one for episode two of Risky Runs Through Porsche. Uh, thank you everybody for tuning into this very first episode and run through. Um, this is my first ever Let's Play series, so I hope you guys like it. If you do like it, make sure to give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you're so inclined. If you want to know when the following episodes are going to come out, uh, I'm going to try to put these out at least once a week. Um, if not more. So I might be doing different series. We will see. You will see. Sub and like and do all that fun stuff. Um, and stay tuned. But until then, thanks for stopping by.